Hello Boise State, I'm Mallory Barker and you are watching The Arbiter Minute. At 11.43 a.m. Friday, April 12th, an unidentified caller phoned a non-specific bomb threat to the main Boise State switchboard. Boise police and campus security officers responded and conducted an investigation and determined that the call was a hoax. A Meridian teenager has since been arrested and charged with multiple felonies. Governor Otter signed a bill into law on April 2nd that will require petitioners to gather 6% of registered voters' signatures from a minimum of 18 districts. Currently, petitioners must collect 6% of registered voters statewide. Starting on July 1st, when Senate Bill 1108 goes into effect, it will be harder for Idahoans to gather enough signatures to place initiatives and referendums on the ballot. This past Saturday, Bronco Nation came out in full support for the 6th annual Beat Coach Pete race, a race against head football coach Chris Peterson. Two brothers, dressed as knights, finished the race in under 27 minutes and took home first place for the costume contest. After the race, the Broncos played in the annual Boise State Blue and Orange Spring Game on the Blue Turf, with the offense coming out on top 28-19. Boise State's first game of the 2013 season is at the University of Washington in the newly renovated Husky Stadium on August 31st. For more news, go to arbiteronline.com and follow the Arbiter Minute on Twitter.